What's up guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Damari and today we are going to be editing one of my favorite photos. This is the Chilean Flamingo and I'm going to show you how to edit it on Lightroom. But before I begin editing this photo, I want to tell you a little bit about me. My name is Damari. I started photography about a year ago and I really liked it. Uh, my favorite subjects are nature. I love photographing nature because everything just puts itself together. Um, that's why this month's theme is going to be about animals. And, and I'm also looking forward to making more videos for y'all on how to edit, how to take good photos, skits sometimes. I really don't know what I'm doing. This is my first video, so well, let's get into it. All right, so we are here in Lightroom and this is the Chilean Flamingo. We're gonna start by taking the exposure down just a little bit in order to create a contrast between the flamingo and the background. So we're gonna take that down just a bit and you can see the contrast already happening. We're gonna take contrast, so we're gonna take that up just a bit right there and you can see its subject is already standing out from the background. We're gonna ignore the highlights and we're gonna to go to the shadows because you want those blacks to really stand out so that it can create a contrast between the background and the subject. That's what really brings out this photo. So we're gonna take those shadows down just like that. We're gonna ignore the whites because we can see the whites there are vibrant already. And we're gonna to go to the blacks. We're gonna take that up just a bit so we can get that shadow very clearly. And take that down and then we're going to move on to color and now the color is very important in this photo it's vibrant it's what we really want to bring out we really want to see the color and the plumage the pink and we want to get it to look as natural as possible so we're going to go to temperature and we're going to take that up because we do want to accentuate the pinks and already you can see that looking very good and we're going to go to Vibrance, and we're going to do the same thing. And so we can have a very crisp and clear photo as well. And then we're going to go to Saturation, and we're going to take that up just a little bit, but not too much, so that it's not too overpowering in the photo. And then moving on, we're going to go to Effects. Now we're going to want to have some very nice, clear photos. So we're going to go to Texture, and we're going to take that up so that the texture looks very nice and very clear in the feathers. And again, this photo is all about contrast. So taking that texture will provide more contrast between the background and the subject. Then we're going to take up the clarity so we can have that clearness of the photo. And then we're going to go on to the detail. And we're going to do just a little bit of sharpening so we can have a really clear photo there. And there you go. There we have it. This is just a little bit of a basic edit. It's not too much. It's just really to bring out the colors and make them look as natural as possible. And right here you have the finished product. What I really love about this photo is the colors and the contrast. As I said before, if you look before, you can see those colors are dull, they're muted. They're not really strongly there. And if you go and look at our after, you'll see that there are so much beautiful and vibrant colors coming through in this photo. And that's what's really important, those colors there. That's what makes it really stand out and make it a very... Well, that is going to conclude it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a like. If you have something to say, go ahead and comment. If you want to see something else, then subscribe. You know the deal. There are so many of the YouTubers out there. I'm just another one. And I will see you in the next video.